Between Poland to Turkey, I think that I recovered physically, but mentally, I broke. I think after Quebec, it was starting to get tough for me mentally just to prepare for each race, especially going into Lemkovina. Like I had a solid two weeks where I couldn't even think about running leading up to the training camp. So I did a training camp, I went in refreshed to that and it went well. And leading up to Lemkovina, I really started to notice the effects of all the racing throughout the year. I think in the first half I pushed way too hard and I think that probably upset my stomach a little bit. Um, I mean, I typically don't run that fast, but I was just kind of going with the flow of people. So I think going at that pace and then trying to eat a substantial amount of food at the aid station, I, I got sick. I think I learned my lesson this year. If you're vomiting for more than two, three hours, put up the white flag, it's okay. Just smile, laugh, and keep going on. Cappadocia Ultra Trail was the race that I had always dreamed about competing in. It was this incredible scenery and topography. And when I was formulating this year, I actually was pretty much formulating it around this race because it was something that I just felt so strongly about and I just was so excited to compete in. Mentally leading up to Cappadocia, it was, it was very hard for me and I didn't know how I was going to bring myself to the start of the race. The night prior to the race, I was a complete disaster. I was just sobbing and crying, like I just broke because I did not know how I could go into another race and go in with that same mental clarity and grit and grind you need to compete in an ultra. I mean, when you're competing so much and you put yourself at the start line every single month, after a while you start to lose yourself in a way and your fire gets extinguished. Two races in a week is definitely not the smartest move. Um, you know, I, I just formulated it based on how my year was going. I didn't think that it would be so challenging mentally. At the commencement of the year, I thought, okay, something's gonna break physically on me. My knee's gonna give out, my back, my hip, something. But I don't think you realize how hard it is mentally to keep going and keep that same fire ignited within you. I finished Cappadocia and I'm very, very happy for that. But I think it was easy to finish Cappadocia because you're just immersed by these incredible landscapes and they're completely riveting. And it's just easy to find that little bit left of grit and grind that you need to finish. I think the most challenging part of the race was just to keep going. And I had to break it up into segments like you always do in an ultra. You can't think of it as a whole, oh my God, I'm running 120 kilometers. It's eight station to eight station to eight station. And that methodical method in my mind was the only way to keep going the entire race. And then when night hit and we started to climb, then it got really challenging because it was you against you and you're fighting against your mind and you're fighting to keep going. I think at the midway point to end, you question why you're in this race, why you're doing what you're doing, because it is pretty crazy what we do as ultra marathon runners. And during this race for Cappadocia, I really was questioning what I was doing. Do you find the answer? No, <laughs> I didn't. I think in part there is still that little bit of fire that I'm, I need to reignite, but I think it's okay to be candid and, be, and say that, you know, sometimes you're not okay during a race and we all go through that. And it's just about taking the time off that you need to repair yourself to reignite that passion. So I decided to not compete in Cape Town because I need a solid two, three months off before going into a new year, new races. And I think that's the smartest move just to recover mentally, physically, do other things that I enjoy cooking, whatever it is, and just regroup, recenter, and go in fresh for Hong Kong. <laughs>